I'm Chris Hernandez with Channel 2. The city's proposed budget is now up for public discussion. So here at City Hall, we held a Twitter budget chat. That means questions and comments from you, the public, came in via Twitter and email, and top city officials personally responded. It's one of those things that we strive for when we do KC Stat is to get people together to look at how um, things cross departmental lines and why it's important for everybody to have a sense of what everybody else is doing uh, because it breeds collaboration and efficiencies that way. And this is just another example of something that I, I commend the manager for doing and that's getting his department heads together to uh, talk about the same subject and see how each of them is impacted by that. I tweet in yes. and then what goes from there? Well, uh, you tweet it in and then we see it up there on the big board. Uh, and then, um, you know, we'll, we'll look at it and have a short discussion about what's the answer and then we'll tweet an answer back. So is there one person tweeting or is everybody in the room tweeting? No, there's a couple of people who are responsible for tweeting. Otherwise, you probably get 15 different answers to the same question. So we have a central tweeter. Uh, type, is, type person and uh, when we have an answer we simply dictate it to them and they type it out and go. Mark is, have, is, is hosting a regional coordinating council to increase regional. But we should say we don't control that but that would be fine. You know, any time that you do something like this I think you're going to have a certain percentage of people who want to talk about the airport or um, the streetcar or things that aren't really budget per se but those are but what it is is a very good insight in what people think are the important topics for them and the the important topic for them may not be the budget but they still get an answer and, and it's good to give them an answer to the extent we can in 140 characters <laughs> I think that this is a very good brain's child of communications and I think that after they take a look at it they may evaluate whether or not to do it again, not do it again, uh, do it again when, that type of thing. But the object of the game is simply to communicate on all levels as many times as possible with the public so that they have an opportunity to ask questions and to get answers uh, relatively immediately. So that's one of the things, regardless of whether or not this turns out to be the ultimate in success or, or not, uh, the success part is the fact that we're communicating with people and giving them an opportunity to ask questions about the budget or whatever else they want to ask. That's a good thing. In just this one hour, the city engaged with residents on more than 30 different topics, in many cases multiple tweets on those topics. For Channel 2, I'm Chris Hernandez.